Hey guys, so as you can tell by the title, a culture festival came to Suwon, which is where I live now. It actually traveled all through Korea. I'm not sure of all the cities that it hit or stopped at, but it did come to Suwon and it came really close to where I live, so I went ahead and checked it out. All right, so the culture festival basically had a lot of performances from different countries. Um, when we arrived, the country was Germany and they did pretty good. It was kind of repetitive, so I did cut it down a little bit but it did bring back memories of when I used to live in Germany myself. So without wasting too much time, let's go ahead and get started with the performances. This is Germany. <laughs> They did do another performance, but I didn't record it. So this is the only clip that I have of Germany. All the countries that performed did do more than one song. So sorry, Germany, I only have this small little clip of your performance, but it was entertaining nonetheless. The next country was China, and they did a really good job. Their performance was very like relaxing and kind of cute. So yes, let's go ahead and check out China. actually made me miss some of the best parts of their performances but I hope you guys enjoyed it anyways all right so now moving on to Russia so you guys you guys <laughs> I was pleasantly surprised by Russia I don't know why like I don't mean to say that like I had like assumed how they were going to do but like it was so entertaining it was so upbeat uh, their footwork and just like how many spins they did it was really really entertaining so let's go ahead and check out Russia <laughs> Thank you. 
stay i was like how are they doing that well i mean i know how they do that but that's really good like that's really good talent right there the next group was japan and after japan finished their performances they kind of explained to us that this group of dancers are just like basically everyday nine to five workers who got together to practice um so that they can come for this performance so they just kind of did that did this on their own time. They're not like professional dancers or anything like that. They just kind of got together and practice and practice and practice for them to be able to do this performance. All right, so let's go ahead and check out Japan, but don't blink because you could miss a costume change in the middle of their performance. <laughs> it you'll kind of get an idea of what the story was about i'm not gonna lie though i got a little bit sad though i did i got a little bit sad <laughs> here's mexico <laughs> Oh, 
those dresses for a second like yes they look so beautiful and as for the story you probably guessed um the, they were hunters and they were hunting the deer or the antelope or whatever it was and uh, yeah at the end it was it was kind of sad it was very like dramatic actually maybe this whole story has like a meaning in like the mexican culture or something that i don't really know about so if you guys know more information about that then just leave the comments in the comment section below to just educate some of us all right <laughs> finally it is korea my country of course i had to save the best for last i don't know you know me i gotta represent my country all right so the rest of this video is just going to be of korea's performance i'm just going to go ahead and let you guys watch that through um with korea i did a little bit biased okay and i put most of their performance in my video check it out watch to the end so that you can see all of Korea's cultural dances and stuff like that. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and also check out my other videos which are linked in the description bar below. Alright you guys, take care and I hope you enjoy the rest of this video. Bye!